I thought I could leave. It won't let me leave. I have no choice but to go into the door. Oh, Melina. Hello again, old friend. Allow me a moment to converse with you. You were unable to enter the Erd Tree, no? Prevented by the mantle of barbs. The thorns are impenetrable. A husk of the Erd Tree's being that spurns all that exists without. The only way to stand before the Elden Ring and become the Elden Lord is to pass the thorns. My purpose serves to aid in that very act. So I'd like you to undertake a new journey with me to the Flame of Ruin, far above the clouds, upon the snowy mountain tops of the giants. Then I can set the Erd Tree aflame and guide you. Down the path to becoming Elden Lord. Oh. I wish to journey with you once more to the Flame of Ruin, then and guide you. Oh, right, I have to go to that other building, don't I? In order to get this thing active. Shall I turn your runes to strength? Let my hand rest upon you. For but a moment, share them with me. Your thoughts, your ambitions, the principles you would follow. So now I can go in this building, right? Divine Tower of West Atlas. It's tight. We block shut. How do I open this building?
The Almond King hewn into the Ur tree. The power of its namesake can be unlocked by the finger reader. Though born one of the graceless omen, Morgoth took it upon himself to become the Ur tree's protector. He loved not in return, for he was never loved. But nevertheless, love he did. Love it he did. Runes, that's a few of the death for companion. Death by companion. Used to restore the fractured Elden Ring when brandished by the Elden Lord. Formed of two hollow brands, half wheels combine it will embed the principle of life within death into order. The Golden Order was created by confining destined death. Thus, the new order will one be one of death restored. Conjoining split medallion depicting the flame peak. Brandishing the medallion activates the grand lift of rolled, connecting Lindell to the mountaintops of the giants. The forge of the flame of ruins is said to be found upon their peaks. And it is here Melina wishes to travel in resuming your journey together. Hmm. Seek the Divine Tower to East Atlas, which stands beyond the Great Bridge of Lindell's Eastern Ward. I'm there now, but how do I... Possible to go lower? Maybe there's a hidden ladder.
I already used that one and that one, and I think I used that one to or did I not use it? I probably did use it. In this ash, it reminds me. If you're heading to the Forge of the Flame of Ruin, in the snowy mountaintops of the Giants, you'll need to find the Grand Lift of Rold, beyond the Forbidden Region. Or go if you would. Take no heed of Cardinal Sin. The Two Fingers lost their purpose a long, long time ago. Two fingers lost their purpose a long, long time ago. What the? Oh, that... that's trippy. Why are they doing that? Well, you managed to return. You know what this means. The Urge Tree has burned you. The fingers remain still, shaken by this turn of events. They are busy consulting the greater will. When they are finished, the fingers will again offer their guidance. But thousands, if not tens of thousands, of moons must first pass. No matter for me, but you. How will you ever manage to wait? My, oh my. Morgoth's Cursed Sword. What blade of shifting hue used by Morgoth the Omen King? The accursed blood that Morgoth resented and sealed away reformed into this blade. Doll of the Cursed Born, borrowed from the Iron Tree Royal Line. Use FP to unleash many raids that chase down foes. Omen, ba Omen babies born of royalty do not have their horns exercised, but instead are kept underground, unbeknownst to anyone, imprisoned for eternity. These memor this memorial fetishes are fashioned in secret. Incantations that channels the power of the ancient dragon Fortisex creates two spears of red lightning that stabs them into the ground from above, one after another. On impact, each spear will burst into trails of lightning covering the area. 
During the War of the Ancient Dragons, these twin red lightning strike stakes were the hallmark of one ancient dragon who was called the mightiest boulder stone death lightning incantation that channels the power of the ancient dragon Fortisax, now corrupted by death strikes surroundings with a storm of death lightning inflicts death blight upon foes charging extenderation of the storm it's said that this golden lightning was wielded by Godwin, who befriended Fortisax. Yeah, that's what it said. But if Godwin befriended him, why was he in the dream? I still don't get it. Heavens forbid. That is not the domain of mere men. The burning of the Erd Tree is the first cardinal sin. And you say you seek the power of the Rune of Death too? The Rune of Death goes by two names. The other is Destined Death. The forbidden shadow plucked from the Golden Order upon its creation. Unleashing the room now would be unthinkable. The fingers would never permit it. Nor would the greater will. Mm. But here we are. The fingers dormant, severing our link to the greater will. The realm and all life in ruins. Impossible events transpire beyond the ken of the fingers. Who is to say that the cardinal sin must be cardinal forever? Go on. Finish the job. Take the course you deem most worthy. Go forth. Let the words of the fingers guide you. Damn, he just covered this whole area in the death mark. Twiggy cracked tear? Crimson tear? Wait, what? Oh, so you can have your flask do all your health with one. Okay. So that's what that was. And briefly stop rune loss on death in mixed physique. Well, that's a good one. Just drinking your potion, you could drink that right before you die, and you'll not you'll not lose all your runes. That's really good. That's a fucking keeper. <laughs> 